with you, I know beyond a shadow of a doubt where my elevator is going. You see, there's, there's two options. It's heaven or hell. You choose Jesus or Satan. You choose holiness or sin. Years ago, I had the chance of meeting somebody who was about ready to gain the world. His name was Kurt Cobain. Met him twice. And anybody who met that guy would think, oh wow, this guy's got the life. Until he's got a head full of lead. Think about it, whether it's Lincoln Park, think about it, whether it's Janis Joplin, think about it. The 27 Club, Jimi Hendrix, the King of Pop, Prince. You know where Prince died? Overdose of fentanyl. You know where he was? He was found in an elevator. He was there for hours. You know what's interesting? Is he sang a song. Do you remember what he said? We ain't gonna let the elevator bring us down. But he did. And he, I don't know where he's at right now, but honestly, there's only one person that you can control where they're going, and that's you. So don't be praying right now for the person next to you. Make sure your soul's right before you pray for them. Because this ain't about them right now, it's about you. Are you right with God? I'm standing right in front of somebody who's a world changer right here. This person will have more crowns in heaven than anybody that you know. And, and this is how you know it. She is so uncomfortable by me saying that right now. You see, there was a lost youth. This guy right here. This guy tried everything that the world had to offer. He did every single jackass thing. I'm talking the movie. And, and had 9,000 lives. So many car crashes, so many flips, so many stunts, so many DUIs, you name it. Every single thing for him was going down. And he was desperate. And he was lost. And he was wandering this very area. And somebody came up to him. This saint right here came up to him and gave him life by sharing God's love with him. By sharing the scriptures with him. And his life was forever changed. And it was two years ago he was sitting right here with a towel around his head watching us and having no idea that a few days later he'd join us on tour and do all 50 states with us. My friends, it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters where you're going. And how do you know for sure you're getting there? Every one of us needs a beautiful soul like this one to speak into our lives, to speak eternal life into our lives. And I want to be that soul right now. I want to tell you God loves you. God loves you just the way you are. But he loves you too much to have you stay that way. Because your sin is hurting you. And it's hurting others. And so you got to fix something, guys. But you can't fix it. Only God can. And that's why Jesus Christ died for you. He died so that you can live an abundant life here, yeah. But what's most important is an eternal life. Because you can gain the world and lose your soul. So right now... I want to give you a chance to see your soul saved. So pray. You know what I mean. Pray. Bow your heads and close your eyes.